3D Via Composer V6R 2011 provides new tools for creating rich technical communications. Beyond paper publications, 3D Via Composer can create documents that can be viewed via websites, other devices such as touchscreen applications in a touchscreen monitor, or even on a factory floor on something such as an iPad touchscreen. How do we do it? First, we need to create an interactive document. 3D Via Composer V6R 2011 provides a lot of great new tools for quickly creating collaborative interfaces. In this example, we want to create a touchscreen interface where the user will be able to pick on an image and go to an existing view. However, these images are somewhat laid out in a sporadic fashion. New authoring tools such as the magnet line make it extremely easy to quickly locate these on my screen in a nice convenient location. You'll also notice that we're working in a true what you see is what you get type interface. Here we have a true sheet of paper which represents exactly what the end user will see when they work with our final documentation. Let's go ahead and zoom that back in. You'll notice in the lower right hand corner I have very easy to use tools much like other Windows applications. If I need to zoom in or out it's a simple drag slider. If I want to zoom to fit I simply click a button. Let's save this view and let's see how it works. Let's get out of design mode and notice that each one of these views will collaboratively take us to the view that it represents. However, our end user is going to need a way to return back to the original view. How do we solve that? Well, we create the exact same interactive storyboard image on one of these views. Here you can see that I want to drag this into the lower corner, position it, but now I need to do that for all those other views as well. A new option in 3D Via Composer V6R 2011 allows us to quickly select a single actor in multiple views and notice we can now update all those views with that selected actor. So now each one of those views has an interactive back button if you would like to call it that. Let's save our final view and let's see how this, this responds inside of the collaborative player. Here in the 3D Via Composer player, we can see each of the individual storyboard views that we've created. This allows a user on a touchscreen device to simply select the view and navigate to the next step in the maintenance manual for the spreader. Clicking the view in the lower right hand corner will quickly take them back. We can see that 3D Via Composer has made it extremely easy to create truly collaborative documents. One final thing on documentation that we've added in 3D Via Composer 2011 is the ability to really adjust section views. This might be great for documentation such as patent information. You can now with a simple check hatch by actor and dragging a slider we can see that all those individual hatch patterns alternate appropriately. This will be great for meeting your company standards for your documentation. If your company needs technical communication on a digital level or even a paper level, 3D Via Composer offers a lot of great tools. Don't forget to look at everything that 3D Via Composer has to offer.